Still in letter A, we're going to follow a similar procedure for the defender. Let's take a look at what we're given. We have the international market value. Okay, so remember, for the defender, you're going to be using the market value as your P. We are given, though, the original price, the $15 million, but it's a sunk cost because it happened two years ago, and we're only concentrating on the values that are current during the time of the analysis. Okay, so we go with the international market value. That's the price that people would be willing to pay for your asset at this point in time. We have the future market values, which we need to calculate. The estimated retention period this is going to be your maximum K. And then we have the annual operating cost, which is 4,000 next year, increasing by 4,000 per year thereafter. It sounds like a gradient up to this point, but then it says that you must add $16,000 next year. They talk about the, this uh, additional cost in the paragraph. But that means that even though it sounds like a gradient, it's not going to start off at 4000 because in, in year number one, you would have to have the 4000 plus 16. So in here, we will have no pattern. meaning that we will be basing uh, this calculation on case number three from the slide 9-11 video. Okay, so then again, it's easier if you put everything in a table. But first of all, let me write down the equation that we will be using. Total annual worth, okay equal to minus P, find a given P at an interest rate in year K, plus the salvage in that year, find a given F at an interest rate for K, minus the annual worth of AOC that we will be calculating because it's not uniform. Okay, so we have year and we only have year zero, year one, year two, and year three. We have our first cost. Then we have the market value, which is your SK. And then we have the annual operating cost. For year zero, we have our P minus 15,000, no more P's here. Then we calculate the market value, which is gonna be 20% less from here. So it's gonna be from 15, it's 1.5, 20% is three, so it's 15 minus three, we have 12K, then 9,600, and then 7,680. And then for the annual operating cost, we start next year. And yes, we do start with the 4,000. But for that 4,000, or well, negative 4,000, we have an additional 16,000, making this minus 20,000 in year one. But then it says that from those 4,000, it's going to increase 4,000. So we have four plus four minus 8,000, and then another 4,000 here, minus 12,000. So yes, it kind of started as a gradient at the beginning for a 12, but then we had this additional cost that made it uh, a no pattern. So here we're gonna have from here to here, and from here to there, it's not uniform. means that there is no gradient. So it's not case one and it's not case two. Just uh, to add here, remember this is your S0, S1, S2, and S3. Okay, so now let's calculate the annual worth 
for each individual year. Annual worth of uh, year one would be minus 15,000. Find a given P at 10% for year one plus salvage value in year one, 12K. Find a given F at 10% for year one. And at this point, then again, we don't know what's gonna happen next. We only have this piece of information. So let's just subtract the minus 20,000. This will give us a total of minus 24,500 for year one. Now let's go ahead and calculate the annual worth of the second year. Minus 15,000 for your first cause, find a given P, 10% for two years, plus whatever we have for salvage value in year two, 9,600 find a given F 10% for two years. And then here's where we have the situation where there's no pattern and we have two values, one in each year. Okay, so basing ourselves in case number three, and I'm gonna do this here at the bottom. We first need to move this to year zero and then this to year zero. So let's start with this one. So I already put the negative sign here. 20,000 find P given F at 10%, this is remember it's an F, so we need to move it to year zero, find P given F, 10%, it's one year away from it, so it's one, plus this one, Remember, I already have my negative. 8,000, same situation. This is an F that I need to move. So find P given F, 10%, but it is one, two years away from year zero. So I put a two. This right here is a result of moving or finding the equivalent value in year zero from here and from there. I have added uh, both values. Now the next step is to distribute the amount that I have into equal amounts for three years. So all of this I am going to multiply it times the factor for find a given P 10% and remember well it's only these two that I need to distribute right now. Oops, let me I close the parentheses early. Okay, so now I need to do this for two years only. Okay, and this will give us minus 18,357. And just the note here that all of this, let me see if I can make this look good. Okay, so all of this, it's to move to P and then this factor right here is to distribute among equal amounts per year. Okay, so we have calculated year two. We're going to do the same for year three. It's gonna be minus 15,000 find a given P, 10%, now three, plus this value right here, 7,680, uh, which is gonna be find P, I mean find A, given F, at 10%, also for three years. And now it's a turn of moving all three of them to year zero. Fortunately, you can re recycle what you already did in year two. These will look exactly the same. 
20k find p given f 10 percent 1 because we again want to move it to year 0 plus 8,000 find p given f 10 percent year 2 because remember it's two years away from it and then we need the last one the 12 that we need to add it here plus 12k that we need to move find p given f 10% and this one is three years away from year zero. Okay, so you just keep on adding the years and then when you distribute it, find a given P at 10%, remember to change the number. So now we're going to distribute it among, since we moved three, we distribute it among three years. Okay, so now for this one, we will get minus 17,000 307. From the 3, the smallest one, it's the last one. So this right here will be your ESL for the defender or in other words it's the annual worth that we will be using for the defender in the replacement study or the best N for the defender.